How's it going everyone? Uh, my name is Tyler and I wanted to make a quick little video just to show, hopefully share something with you that I just learned today. Uh, it's how to determine the wetting pressure of your carbonation stone. Uh, this is useful when you're trying to force carbonate your beer using a carbonation stone on like a, for example, I have an SS uh, Brewtech Uni Tank, or if you have a similar system, and of course this also applies on a commercial scale, but if you're dealing on a commercial scale, I doubt you are watching this video. Uh, basically, what you need to find out before you carbonate your own beer using a carbonation stone is the wetting pressure of the stone, which is basically how many pounds, how many PSI of gas you need to run through your stone before you actually get bubbles through it. Um, very simple to do. All you need is your CO2 tank, regulator, line, couple clamps in your stone, just a very simple setup. And a bowl of water, I actually have star sand, uh, star sand mixture here just for more dramatic effect, hence the uh, foam there. Um, to do this, it's very, very simple. You get your stone set up in there, get everything ready, and you will just very gradually turn up the CO2 and make a note of what your regulator says. I've already determined the wetting pressure of this stone, so I will just gradually crank that up for you so you can see. Sorry, it's a poor angle. I didn't rehearse this. As you gradually turn it up, you'll see some bubbles come out of there. You will eventually see some bubbles come out of there. There we are. That's a little aggressive there. You kind of want to walk a line between basically little diffusion and high, diff you know, nice steady trickle. Remember, we're trying to get CO2 into solution and not uh, scrub the CO2 out of our beer. That is a method you can uh, do if your beer is overcarbonated, is kind of bump it up, bubble it out. That'll actually help CO2 break out of solution and then you'll burp your tank. But you kind of want to get a nice little trickle, slowly build pressure inside of the tank. Um, Looking at my regulator, basically zero PSI. So my determination would be that the wetting pressure of this carb stone in particular, a little two incher for a five gallon uni tank is zero PSI. Hopefully I'm right. Hopefully this is helpful for you. If it is, leave a like. If not, let me know what I did wrong. I appreciate the feedback. Bye.